Right, the effect of presenting more money than you have. Um, this goes back to what a lot of scammers do. Um, as your forex traders. The scammy forex traders, not every forex trader is a scammer, but there's a lot of forex traders who are scammers. Anyway, so often what happens is, one, a lot of these forex traders are not actually traders. They actually can't trade. But what they can do is they can give the perception that they have a lot of money and they understand that, and this is a phenomenon, they understand that people like to be around people who have money and many people are willing to pay to be around people who have seemingly a lot of money. And so what they do is, rather than actually learning to trade again, we will get, we'll get to that. But rather than actually learning to trade, they focus on perfecting the marketing aspect. Perfecting the image of having money through trading so that you can want to try and get close to them and give them money in hopes that you will get money from giving them money, if that makes any sense. So, the, the deep understanding behind this is really that a person generally believes that if they are around people who have money, around a network of people who have money, the probability of them making money increases dramatically. One of the reasons for this is, again, you're going back to the law of averages. So, if, again, you know, you've got four friends... Um, you're going to be the average of those four friends as the fifth person on average, right? So the idea, even though they won't tell it to you, but when you look deep, the basic idea behind this is if all my friends are millionaires, then I should become a millionaire in in, in that kind of logic. It's, at some point, it starts to make some sense, but that's kind of the underlying reasoning behind it, which then means... If I get these people close by, the probability of me not making money when I've got four friends who have BMs and Mercedes, there's no way I'm not going to get a car, at least a car, right? So that's like the general understanding behind it. Now, the reason, now the way to get in, into that then becomes, well, this person's um, doing one, two, and three. Let me get close. Even if it's going to cost me 500, it'll cost me 500 and I'll eventually make it to making 5000 10 50000 a month, etc., etc. So that's the underlying thing behind it. But there's a bit of a catch. 